there are a lot of locals all, all, that have sub Yeah, they have power. Yeah. Okay, this is the site, you know, like I said, after 2009, we were dealing with FEMA for a couple of years, trying to get money. But what we did do during that time, <laughs> we purchased this site for the new treatment plan. It was about $100,000. It was about a million dollars. Yeah, a million dollars. A million dollars. A million dollars here, a million dollars there. You lose track. I just tried to get it, I just tried to get it done. So money, you know, is me, just give me the money, I'll get it done. But this shows this was the initial plan. Remember, this this project was done. This stock project was bid and awarded well ahead of the treatment plan. The plan, the original plan was this is the force main comes in. This is the EQ tank headwaters. From there, it would feed down to the old plant, be treated until the new treatment plant came online. Now we may not even have to do that. And ultimately, even when the new treatment plant comes online, they'll still use that line and will connect to the existing outfall line at the old treatment plant, course, it still discharges to the river. And this is work going on at the headworks. A lot of it's the footings for the EQ tank. You can see. Uh, the uh, equalization, uh, the, uh, the headworks, uh, are another pump station there. One of the unique things about these pictures is that what you see above ground, <clears throat> there's a ton of money below ground. All the piping, valves, everything associated with those, these structures has got to be put in. Stormwater's got to be put in, drainage. So all that's already in place. So that work has been ongoing now to get the above ground structures. 